y'all know that right now but if i'm doing my review on bologna she is a warrior yes i have her diamond that's besides the point i feel like lately my bologna has been low on damage as in she just does not hit hard things i guess you can do i'm gonna read her powers bologna dashes forward and bashes people with her shield different Slowing enemies. Bologna gains one stack of block for each enemy hit. Block absorbs all damage. I mean, you guys can't read this stuff, but mainly when I play Bologna, you know, the more basics you hit with her shield bash ability while she's in shield form, that's what I call it, she can get, uh, you know, reflect, which is what, a 30% reflect? So not all of it is reflected, she takes partial damage. But that reflect if it hits in a cone. So if someone's shooting a projectile and you're already basic, odds are she's gonna fucking, you know, block that off. Now, it hits very well. It's like gambling with it, but I have a lot of luck when it comes to her uh, reflecting. I don't know why, but I guess the more attacks you give her, the higher your chances of reflecting are as well. So keep that in mind. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Well, damage when she hits that prior shield bash does do a decent chunk. You have to kind of build her to do that damage, though. Unless you're going at full attack speed, Bologna, just to be on someone's butt. I've done it a lot. Um, her slow rate for the higher you rank it goes, you know, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. And it's only for two seconds, so it's not really a major thing. You can build Frostbound Hammer to keep your enemy slowed. It's a thing you kind of want to do if you're going to build Chaser Bologna to where she can just rampage and chase you throughout tower. I'm a Jouster, so that's the type of thing I do. I play Joust a lot. I don't really go for, you know, the main game mode of Conquest. Arena's pretty good, but Bologna in that game mode for me is lackluster. A lot of people like to Hound and beat on her. It depends how you're playing her. I've seen people use crit, attack speed, slow, defense, and still go ace. But when it comes to my Bologna, she does not hit hard at all. Anyway, bludgeon. <laughs> this is something I even wanted to know. So Bologna summons her hammer and spin and hits every enemy around her when it, when it smashes, I guess. Forward in the overhead strike. Each attack on the god hit and spin increases the damage of the overhead attack. Bologna now makes it basic attacks with her hammer until she's not taking damage or dealt damage in at least 7 seconds. So it's 7 seconds that she can switch it back into her, you know, basic form with just big two-handed sword. Huh. That I didn't know of. Let's see. Hmm. Every hammer attack, all enemies in range benefit from 33% of Lana's total damage life steal. Bologna has life steal and bludgeon. That's something I didn't even know. I think they mean scurred. she gets a heal back from smashing the enemy with the bludgeon that i won't know until it's tested i had never paid that attention but we'll move on to her third ability which is scourge Bologna summons a you know scourge which is i call it life steal whip uh you can call it anything you want but this thing pretty much hits enemies in a line and disarms them and they cannot make basic attack for possibly you know one second up to two seconds de derived on how you you know i guess build it so, Bologna now makes basic attacks with Scourge until she has taken damage or dealt in the last 7 seconds. With all of her abilities, there's a 7 second delay of if you stop attacking, you will lose that ability. So, 
take caution. If you're not hitting anything, you're going to be pulled back into your basic stance of just holding that two-handed sword. Um, she heals for the third hit of everything, so you can build her life still, Bologna. I've had my build stolen a couple of times, so you have to be careful when you're playing Bologna. There's many ways you can play her. You can play her heavy damage, tank, or just bruiser. But my favorite is chase whoop your ass while you're not really paying attention. Sorry if I'm saying ass, but I'm not sorry. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, she can disarm people for two seconds. Her healing derives up to, well, it goes to 25 all the way to 45. It depends on how many times you spec it. Maybe you don't spec it at all, but if you hit level 20, you might want to spec all abilities. We all know that. Uh, Eagle's Rally. Blona, well, for me, she jumps on top of you with a flight pull and stuns you for about one second. It does a good amount of damage, but the stun is the only thing you really want for that. Uh, it gives you protections up to 15 through 35. The uh, power outage is, you know, 20 through 60. The magical power, it, it even affects anyone that's magical. Pretty much, it's her rally flag. If anyone on your team steps in it, they get a boost in damage. And it sits there for about 8 seconds. Everyone knows to stay out of that circle. Because I'm pretty sure if the enemy team gets in it, they get a hefty nerf. So, uh, Valonas normally use this to kill. As in, I'm going to leap on you, get that stun, bash you with my shield, or hit you with hammer. Which, hammer sounds like a smart idea now that I think about it. Reading this actually is helping me, you know, open up another way of playing her. Um, all in all... Bologna is a very good god when it comes to damage, but I feel like I just don't build her right to, to make her, you know, swing. As in, one minute she's hitting you soft, next minute she's bulldozing through your whole team. Uh, Master of Warp. Pretty much, Bologna gets these little ticks. I think after the fifth hit of something, it stacks five. But she gets like a movement speed increase per stack, which she's very, very good on movement. Bologna's probably one of those guys that's just built for Chase to be ridiculous. So, odds are, if you're going to go in and be a big beefy, you can play Bologna. Make sure you have some defenses, but you have to also know when to hold it and fold it. Because if you're too greedy with Bologna, you will be punished for it. I suggest you try to learn jukes before anything. Juking is the main part of the game if you're going to play Bologna juke hit if you don't want to wear defenses but if you're wearing defenses you can take the mitts to the face and just stay in whip stance and keep healing if you've built life still in defenses and attack speed or something it's it's whatever you want to build me primarily i feel like she doesn't do enough damage and the reason is i don't build her penetration i don't use yotin's wrath or none of that i kind of just go with some like soft tier starter stuff and just bully one person Bologna's main weakness, in my opinion, and for me, her main oh, weakness I am ready ready for be here when this is, over. is probably just taking her away from her allies and leaving her alone. So kill the two squishies, leave her for last. But even still, Bologna can swing 1v fucking 3. I've seen it, but I've never been able to do it unless I'm ahead of the game. I won't lie to you. This is my favorite scene. I'm not even trying to look at the butt. I am trying to look at the butt.